Hello students, how are you all? Doing well? I hope so. The students, do you know? Every cloud has a silver lining. And I think this proverb needs no explanation. Children, let me tell you about one fruit. You know, success. It tastes better. I would wonder. Why is Sodi saying so? Yes, it is better. Until and unless you drip it with the drops of your sweat. Yes, children, success is sweetest to those who work hard. So, with this, I start my today's presentation. Children, I know, exams are near. I feel you are stressed. Children, do you know? Every stress is not bad. Okay, let me discuss with you the types of stress. Children, there are two types of stress. One is you stress or good stress. And second is distress or bad stress. Let's first discuss about you stress. Children, do you feel butterflies in your stomachs when you are going to do something important? Do you feel your nerves tightening so that you are going to cover something very important? Yes, sure. That time you are having the symptoms of good stress. Alright, second kind of stress, which is distress. Children, do you feel you are suffering from kind of nausea, fever, your nerves are aching, when you are going to do something important, children that is distress, avoid it, okay, so what I told you that two kinds of stresses are there, what is you stress, what is distress, you stress will make you fly high in the sky, but distress will pull you down. So I hope that now you will not take the stress seriously because stress is good. You stress forces you to cover up everything. It makes you feel confident. Alright children, let me talk to you more intensively. Alright? Okay, let me discuss with you the techniques which you can use to cover up your studies. Two kinds of studies are there, children. One is comprehensive study and one is intensive study. Comprehensive study means when you cover the entire syllabus. It gives you confidence. And children, intensive study means when you delve into the topic, when you dive down into the particular topic and get the essentials out of it. Alright, so these are the two methods. One more thing I would like to share with you. See, if you are not getting any particular topic, just leave it there. Move on to another. After some time, come back to Then you will find that you are getting that topic. See, it's one technique of sidelining one thing and again going back to it. Alright? So children you can use these techniques. And one more thing I would like to share with you. Take care of your health. Children with a stressed body and a stressed mind you won't be able to give the best. So take care of health, take care of your body, take care of your mind and at last I would like to say all the best for exams. Thank you, children.